Hi guys and welcome back to another game review. Today is one of my most anticipated games of 2014, Destiny. Destiny is a first and third person RPG action adventure first person shooter. So as I did in the previous video, I'm going to start with the good points that I experienced playing Destiny over the last few days. Um, first one is, of course, there's multiple worlds, loads of side quests, loads of story missions, quite a, I guess, um, intriguing story. It's not what I'd call my top, uh, it, it doesn't really interest me that much, but the, the gameplay is really good, so that, you know, sort of makes it up for me. Um, there's lo like I just said, there's lots of stuff to do, uh, loads of side missions, you can explore free roam in different uh, worlds. Uh, for example, in Earth you can explore Old Russia and do extra missions on top of side missions and story missions, which is really cool. The ability for up to three player co-op is always a good thing. Any type of co-op in any multiplayer game is always a good thing nowadays. Being able to play with your friends just makes the game, the for station. me personally, more this enjoyable. And especially with this game, I find it a lot more enjoyable playing with friends and on my own. I found it quite boring playing on my own. Doing the same stuff of course, but it's just more fun playing with friends. Just have a laugh. Now for my bad points. Um, first off, the netcode. I found that this was mainly on multiplayer when, you know, PvP, etc. Um, it, it wasn't the greatest it's an enjoyable multiplayer, it's just lag, netco, whatever you would like to call it, just sort of ruins it a bit really. Like you can trade punch which is a bit ridiculous, um, get shot behind cover, just like in Battlefield 4. Although it's not as extreme as that, it is playable, it's just a bit frustrating when you know, you just done really well killed like five people with your super duper ability thing and uh, you get run over by someone who five seconds ago wasn't there but you know it's, uh, it's just annoying. Another bad point is getting randomly disconnected from the destiny servers it's weird it's like I said it's completely random uh, you're just playing with your friends and then suddenly you get an error message pop up saying that you've been disconnected and uh, yeah it's, it's very annoying. I also found the voice acting quite bland, quite b boring. Um, I, I don't know what they were trying to go for the um, <laughs> really I just found it, it is, I don't know it's really boring to listen to I guess because everyone sounds the same now my final one um, if you could leave a comment on this one if you agree or disagree because I feel that the PvP multiplayer is a little unbalanced in the sense that I, I'm currently level 11 and I've been put in multiplayer matches with level 30s 40s and obviously the higher the level you are, the better gear, defense, damage you deal. So I'm sitting there with my little assault rifle that does like 90 damage and then it comes along a level 30 with a 200 damage weapon which can almost insta kill me really. And it's, it, it's a bit annoying really they could at least maybe try and put you maybe do a matchmaking system where it's every 10 levels so if you're level 1 to 10 you're put into matchmaking servers if you're level 11 to 20 another one maybe I don't know tell me your opinions on that um, did annoy me a little bit but you know I'm moving the game as well so that has been my destiny review um, please leave a comment if you enjoyed or if there's a game you want me to do a review on next whether it's one of your favorite games i guess um coming to next gen of course um 
and subscribe if you want more uh, and want to see more of me for whatever reason. Um, like and favourite if you really enjoyed it. And that is all from me. I will leave you with the rest of this gameplay. It is pretty sweet. And I'll see you next. Goodbye. Array is controlled by the last war monitor. That's you. It's connected to defense constructs all across the system. There could be something out there to help us survive the darkness. <laughs>